Tonight, what started the blaze is under investigation. The entire neighborhood mourning the lives lost in this fire. Difficult to accept that among the victims, three of them were children, one of them just a baby. Behind the vicious flames of family trapped inside, the video captures what it looked like. Beyond the images, the smell of smoke and cries for help. I saw early in the morning, 6 o'clock, they was yelling, Allah, help, help. And the flame burst through the windows and the fire was high all the way up. Firefighters got to 2165 Quimby Avenue in the Castle Hill section of the Bronx just after 6 in the morning. We arrived here a little over four minutes. We immediately went to work removing some of the victims. First responders pronounced two boys dead at the scene, a 12-year-old and a 10-year-old. It's not my family, but it hurts me because I have kids too, says this woman. A 22-year-old man and a 10-month-old baby girl were rushed to Jacoby Medical Center but didn't make it. They died shortly after. First responders say a 21-year-old woman and a 41-year-old man are at that same hospital in critical condition. I saw the, um, the dad. He was downstairs. He was panicking. He's saying his family, his children upstairs. I run back to my house uh, to get a hammer so he could try to get in the house. He tries to break through the, the door, but he couldn't break in. So he tried to break the window, but he was just like panicking, like just hammering everything. For those in the neighborhood who witnessed what happened, it's heartbreaking, something they will never forget. I was thinking about, oh my God, these people need help, help, help. All the neighbors start to run out with their phone calling the fire. Mayor Adams went by the destroyed home this afternoon, sharing the sorrow so many feel. I can't imagine one child, let alone three, you know, so that was just horrible. The flames stretched to this home next door. We're told those inside scramble to get out and they will all be okay. At the home where the blaze started, a reminder tonight of how fragile life really is.